could go and scour the shops of the world for some low-rent Christmas tat to point at and laugh. And I'll tell you what, a bit of a sad note this year. This is the last year we will feature anything from 99p stores. Because they have been purchased by Poundland, and I believe over the next year they will be absorbed into the mothership and disappeared. I think that's the technical financial term, absorbed into the mothership. Also, I can't remember, actually, if any of the items did come from 99p stores. So maybe we've already had our last from them for the Yuletides. Oh, uh, anyway, who gives a shit? It's Christmas. And when you think Christmas, do you think of bubbles? Me neither, because they've got piss all to do with Christmas. But what if those bubbles were spewed forth from the mouth of Father Christmas himself? Oh yeah, this is quite horrible. Welcome! The Santa bubble blowing gun thing. Let's just take a second to go through the details here. Here's your bubble fluids shoved up Santa's arse. There's his little feet, there's his little hands. There's his gigantic bonce. And on the back there's kind of a toy laser gun thing going on with a pistol grip and a bright green trigger to fire forth the stream of bubbles from his holy mouth. You may be wondering, why haven't you turned it to face the camera yet? <clears throat> yeah, getting a little bit Zardoz, isn't it? Quite terrifying on many levels. Merry fucking Christmas! Yep, I can't really think of much else you would want less than this thing in your life capacity. Anyway, what happens when you shove three triple A's into it? No wait, double A's. Even more of the old power. And hold down the trigger. So, basically, plays a shitty version of Jingle Bells and flashes some LEDs, including this particularly bright one here. I made sure to look away before I did that, so I caught myself in the eyes of it when I was testing it originally. You'll also be pleased to hear that the siphoning system for the bubble fluid doesn't pissing well work, so he will actually never spew forth bubbles. Oh, isn't that a shame? No bubbles for you! And you, you can see even like, how it would cut them off, the little thing there, but just doesn't work. Instead, it just looks bleeding terrifying. Anyway, thank you to whoever sent that in 45 years ago. I only found it up again recently and basically shit my pants when I looked into its eyes. I am an angry god! Right, what's coming up next then? Well, I tell you what, it's always nice to feature something made out of those shitty plastic scabs that has some sort of colour changing LCD in it. There's a different one every year, and this year here it is. Also, I'm an LED, not LCD. That would be much cooler. Yes, it's a Christmas star. It's got a little bit of tinsel around it. Made out of uh, slightly putrescent looking reddy orange scabs. Loads of shitty glue all over the eyes and left on the face. Pipe cleaner mouth thing going on. Turn it on. And it starts off sort of red and then tries to change colour, but frankly it doesn't work very well because there's already a colour to the outside of it. You know, in many ways, um, every year there is a different one of these, and they always seem to sum up Christmas for me these days. What a tragic situation. Right, time for something far more beautiful. When you're drinking your eggnog or your cheap shitty wine, you can have this rather fetching glass. At least, I think it's still technically a glass. I think it may, however, have transformed.